Was everybody do, 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 crypto muscle do, 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 pumping iron to pump crypto do, 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 coming to you in a YouTube video? Here we are in the national now, worldwide, and get his words at crypto muscle and the crypto muscle network coming to you in a YouTube video. Let's talk about some of these platforms, all right? Um, you know, I've been trying to stay on top of the things that goes on with these platforms. Um, by the way, you are watching the critically acclaimed Death Watch series, and one thing I do like to uh, talk about when it comes to the Death Watch series is, you know, documenting the end of these platforms that are here but don't want to be acknowledged by either the platform itself or the people that are in it, right? And, you know, I, I hate to be the bearer of bad news and the brunt of being the YouTuber that tells you the bad news because no one else wants to do it. So I, I got to be the guy to do it, you know, because I always say it's a disservice when these fools out there don't tell you the reality of what's happening here and that it's over, right? So with that, uh, <laughs> Either, you know, there's a lot of crickets going on, as in, that's all you hear, right? You, you hear silence, you hear crickets, all right? And uh, the truth of the matter is, the shit's done. That's just that's just what it is. Like, for example, let's just take this Echo One, all right? It hasn't paid since December 24th. We're a week away from being two months of no pay and no really true updates, because Marco's dick bag supposedly is in touch with the admins and all that. And the last we heard anything major about Echo One's people and what's going on with them is that the main admin got into a car accident and broke his back, <laughs> which is like, how lame is that? And on top of that, the CEO was fake, right? That's what they talked about. They talked about how the CEO was fake. So this is all a recipe for a disaster that they don't want to just outright say that they stopped paying, that it's over, that there's no way they're coming back. Except they're just going to continue to take your deposits while dickheads out there like Marco's dick bag doesn't care about you and uh, continues to just move on with supposedly he had a $30,000 deposit in this thing. Oh my gosh, you know, but he's not really sweating bullets at all about it, you know, so... That just really tells you that it was fake. And I, I can confirm that for sure, that it was fake anyways. That's why he doesn't give a shit. Right? So, anyhow, um, latest update for Echo 1 is that there is no update. All right? Which is funny as hell. Because uh, I've been telling you guys this. You know, uh, let's see here. January 3rd. And then I went into the weekend. So, after that January 3rd. We're looking at around the uh, timeline. January 8th is when I officially said these guys are done. All right. Because I gave it the weekend after the weekend of them not paying out withdrawals to say that these guys are done. Well, you have ass bags out there like Marco's dickhead that tells you, oh, don't worry, guys. Uh, see, I was fake. And then, uh, you know, the admin got into a car accident and broke his back. Hopefully, we can just pray that he's okay and they're doing okay and that they'll pay, and we'll pray that they'll pay us still. Get the fuck out of here, man. So, anyhow, <laughs> the, the watch is in progress and it's still not here. It's been done, all right? I, I think I'm a day early. I should have probably just let the weekend go through, but I felt like it's been long overdue for a, a death watch update, you know? So, that's why I wanted to go into these things and talk about it, all right? So, that's that. Um, let's talk about LG, all right, LG, Lance Green, all right, so, <laughs> uh, let's see here, we'll, we'll go back to the middle of the week, because that's the last we talked about what was going on here, all right, and so, um, you know, we'll see what, if there's any new progress being made, and all I got to say is, no, <laughs> Lance Green is, is done, I mean, I don't know why people are just like, hoping and praying that these things will come back anytime these platforms take a break like this there's no way that they come back 99.9% .9 of the time with uh, exceptions that they'll come back and pay is very very rare the uh, only time I've ever seen one come back from the time I've experienced platforms very very rarely but Metagens Metagens actually came back for like a month before they actually called it quits 
which is crazy. But other than that, you can't you can't count Quopi because all they did was made an illusion that oh they're back and they're hitting up everybody's emails to reopen their accounts. All you had to do is just put in some bots in the Telegram group to say oh my platform's back on is paying again and blah 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 blah. And uh, it fools people into putting new deposits into it. So Quopi doesn't count, all right? Metagence was actually legitimately paying, all right? Without any, putting any fresh new money in, it was just paying, which is crazy. Because I was there. I was experiencing it. Um, anyhow, let's talk about Lance Green, all right? Let's see. So this is the admin here, uh, Paul. All right. <laughs> what a dummy. Uh, let's see. There will need to be an official statement from the company on how they will handle buy balance. There are new and old funds in the buy balance so that will take time to figure out. The main mission is to build momentum. How can you build momentum if you're not paying? There's, there's zero momentum. All right. Um, to get as many people earning with new money they have sent. Also to help people that have made a withdrawal. Anything else is up in the air. This is the main motivation, but we're still waiting for an official word. <laughs> yeah, get ready to hear an official word, which is nothing. Uh, remember to be as accurate as possible when it kinds of blah, blah, whatever. All right, let's see here. Uh, I would hope the company would have a record of what was in the buy balance. I have no record of what was in there. Paul, we have a clear, we have a dear friend who purchased one sports contract on January 18th. Do I need to do anything on his behalf? Yeah, <laughs> kiss that money goodbye, all right? Uh, you shouldn't have put money in during this period of not paying. All right, so if you saw this but still allowed your friend to put it in, then you screwed your buddy, you screwed your friend. Uh, it has to be after January 23rd. Thanks, John. So we believe, all right? <laughs> we believe there would be, they will get the answer, right answers on the 21st. Uh, Kathy and Paul, there, you know, were there for us in good times and bad. Saw the problem in such a way that no one is harassed or abused. It would be good for everyone. Get out of here, man. Although there was something contradictory enough to delete the message I posted, I can't imagine if you're working for the good of this group. Lighten up, everyone. This wasn't Lance Green's fault. It was pure and simple greed on the part of some or many. I don't know uh, participants. Give them some grace to get in corrected, put in the blame, blah, blah, blah. We have been totally at peace. We have entertained all negative thoughts. All right, so they had a Zoom call on the 16th, all right? Anything come out of that Zoom call? Let's see here. Uh, anything to report? Good things are coming soon. Is he just saying that, or is that from the Zoom call? Did they say when the withdrawals will start again? Uh, hello, were there any important updates? Kathy and Paul were their positive selves, reassuring everyone that Anderson, Thiago, and... Uh, Tiago and uh, Jeremy were meeting and getting things back on track. It was indicated that we should see something moving forward next week. Um, they not even releasing the 10% though, so no char changes as of yet. Only thing uh, any of us can do with El Green is wait. Um, and that uh, to be sharp and ready for the call, nothing wrong with that. Alright, so whatever. <laughs> Come next week, nothing still, all right? Because it's going to be some way of you got to pay to get paid something, right? They're not even doing the 10% they promised. So what makes you think that anything is going to come out of all this if they're not even fulfilling the initial negotiated rate here of, oh, well, you could withdraw 10% of your overall earnings, uh, which a lot of people can't make anyways on one hand, you know, because it's $50 minimum withdrawal. And then at the same time, uh, if you are able to meet that 10% mark at a $50 minimum, well, um, no one's able to get it yet, All right? And this was weeks ago when they settled upon this 10%. So yeah, L Green is done. The longer this holdout happens, the, the worse it's just going to continue to be. In terms of, um, you know, the inevitable, it's over. It's done. I mean, what makes you think they're going to pay? Uh, oh, they're building up funds in their account, and then now they're going to release it? Get out. No, they're not doing that. All right? They never do that. In the end, 
these things run like a typical platform would do. When there's a period of no withdrawal, they don't ever come back to pay unless you pay to play, right? So that's just what it is. Um, shit, it's been, man, at least over a month of not being with, at least. I would have to log in to see the last time I got paid, but I would say at least the beginning of January, right? And we're well over a month past that. And the longer it goes, the worse it's going to be. All right. Um, yeah, so good luck with that shit. These guys are not coming back. And that's fine if the system was being gamed with uh, binary upon binaries upon each other. They got no one else to blame but them because they didn't police it. They didn't monitor it. And we all know that that's a recipe for disaster when you're you know doing shit like stacking wallets in the drip network and uh, doing these binaries and come in under me and I'll come in under you type of thing on binaries. Where they would, uh, you know, do shit like that and bot it up and everything. You know, bot as in B-O-T, right? And all the stuff that they do to try to game the platforms. Well, they succeeded. The gamers succeeded the platform and they got screwed. And it's just over. It's done. You can't fix it. All right? And, and it's over. They had a good run. It was nice and steady for a year. Hey, you know, all the good things come to an end. It just sucks. Good thing that I was slow. You know, every time I act slowly, because I'm, in, in a sense, it's kind of hesitating, all right? I'm, and so I go slow, right? And because I don't do it fast enough, I'm slow. And the more I'm slow, the more I just don't do it in the end. And that sort of slow hesitation really does well for me because every time I've done that, <laughs> things happen. And then next thing you know, it doesn't work out. I was getting ready to put in, uh, a new deposit to increase, you know, the next step in the, you know, in the, in this whole uh, package series on L green, right. Uh, to upgrade. And I was just so hesitant. I talked about, I kept pushing it off. I talked about it in December. Then I said, okay, after the new year, I'm going to go ahead and do it after the new year came. And I was just like, yeah, I'm, I'm thinking about, it. I'm getting ready to do it. And then that happened. And I was like, wow. So this, the slow response that I do sometimes actually serves me well because I could have got screwed big time and be at a loss of at least a $1,500 upgrade. And so um, it's unfortunate, you know. But I, I just don't think L Green is going to be back like you think it's going to be. You're going to be paying in some shape or form and then uh, you'll be lucky to get anything back even after you pay, you know, which is pretty funny as well. So I'm just going to laugh at you guys for that. Uh, so that's L Green, all right. And uh, let's take a look at the Banger update because Banger is one of those ones that they're just going to try to keep going, even though we already know that it's been over. All right, they already announced it. Let's see if um, I think someone might have removed that message here. Let me see. Yeah, they removed the message here, <laughs> talking about Banger is over. They deleted everything out of this community chat. Uh, that's unfortunate because now it, it leaves everybody else hanging over here that it's been done. It's over. Right? But these guys in this leadership chat is going to say, oh, it's, don't worry, guys. Okay? Um, no, this is funny, though. I read this part. So there's this economic data news, right? It's talking about what's going on in the market. And so because of that, for Banger Network and the community, there's volatility because of this volatility that's been happening in the market on Valentine's Day here, that, uh, you know, it, it's the volatility is affecting the way bangers playing, you know, paying and playing, right? And so this approach not only aims to mitigate risk, but to capitalize, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and so does this mean for us with banger? What does that mean? And what the F is this? Are you effing mocking us after investing in an effing scam project that, that has not given us any update, but has gone silent and then taken our capital for someone, for someone to go silent? Uh, today was the first over some long time of trips of all team meetings. So therefore, the team received new direction and we are getting more alive. Don't see anything bad in this. Um, all right. So they had a team meeting. Oh, my gosh. Right. In a series of meetings. <laughs> Hello. And can anyone make withdrawals a banger? I haven't been able to do so for weeks. I know. I called that out. I called that out weeks ago. Go look at my banger videos. I talked about it weeks ago. 
as these guys are really screwing you guys over and um, it's unfortunate you know Eugene will soon be available and answer your guys's questions all right yeah right uh, why don't you book out the accredited packages then is liquidity there and you can pay us out uh, it's a scam okay so they speak another language a part of the credit package is already blocked. As stated, each of them is monitored individually so that work on blocking proceeds. Uh, some deserve to have their servers remain uh, well, because with Banger, they refer to their you know packages, their plans. They call them servers, right? Because they were supposedly the concept was to run off of servers. Uh, let's see here. Dear Eugene, first of all, I have to tell you that I'm very disappointed with Banger's actions. A lot was promised and nothing was kept. That's exactly what I said weeks ago. I said that weeks ago. Regardless of whether it's about staking income, new developments on the platform or promised advertising activities, unfortunately there is no sign of anything of progress. Uh, I know it probably won't interest you, but I'm currently in a difficult phase of my life and unfortunately I'm also Independent on income, blah, blah, blah. I request Banger hereby order me to immediately reimburse all profits. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, accrued to date as well as my entire investment. Yeah. Good luck with that shit. Uh, if Banger Network does not comply with my request, I will file a complaint with the office in Vienna. Ooh, good luck with that shit too. Uh, with all the recordings of the Zoom meetings and IP addresses that I was able to document when using the platform and the commu communication handle hand it over to the authorities if there is no agree disagreement or there's no agreement i will start an online campaign yeah good luck with all that stuff uh finally all that remains for me is to say is that banger could have been a really good project which i agree i, I agree it could have been it had, it had the promise uh but just i don't know just wasn't that good you know in the end it, it really screwed people over especially uh the constant maintenance and uh, the constant maintenance is what really screwed people over, screwed me over. And so the non-compliance of promise activities and pay profits, all trust now is lost and there's no longer any future for Banger. Uh, I've not received any payment. And if I don't have an answer by Monday, February 19th, I will consider my claim not to be met. Uh, blah, blah, blah. All right, so let's see here. We understand, who's this guy? So someone from Banger here admin we understand your concern you raised fyi a profit withdrawal was already processed by the system some long awaiting periods please note that further withdrawals are as well okay the way for sure we kindly ask to remain patient and avoid jumping to hasty conclusions uh yeah it these guys are not paying these guys are just full of shit you know uh thanks for confirming Anyway, to send me point zero one <laughs> does not change my mind. <laughs> oh man, uh, Banger did not follow his promoted payment regulations, and now I use my special cancellation rights on that event. My lawyer is actually doing research and all that. Yeah, good luck with all that. Let's see, point zero one. I got to see what point zero one of B and B is, right? Let's see here. Point zero one. And what is BNB right now? Let me uh, look up BNB here. I think it's going to be actually pretty funny to see. So BNB is 351. All right. So let's see how much he got sent. 351 and 0.01 was $3.51. All right. So pretty funny. All right. Funny shit. Um. <laughs> Point zero one. It's, it's, it's funny as hell. Uh, I'm waiting for more than one thousand for payout, and you pay out ten bucks. Wow. Uh, I'm happy to share with everyone's group the progress of my legal intervention. Also, be grateful for any information you can provide to my lawyer. Okay, whatever. I uh, remind you that withdrawals are going out. To have them, you need to sell your bank and have BNB on your balance. So your actions. Now seems rushy and nervous. Uh, DM, DM us if you have not received your part of last withdrawal, which happened yesterday. I got more than one BNB in in the wallet, 
and to get 0 0.01 does not match 12% profit monthly. Your message also tells us that Banger will not cancel my contract, so I guess it's now up to the authorities and blah, blah, blah. It's funny how they do these threats, you know. What do you mean, cancel contracts? I want to leave the project, cancel my contract. We'll ask the team if that's possible. No, it's not possible. Please do that. It would save Banger and me a long legal battle. Look at that, empty threats. I'm waiting for a 3.4 BNB and you pay out 0 0.01 in one month. That's a joke, sorry. I love the project, but now everything this company is doing is so sad. All right, so uh, let's see here. It was not the only payout done in the last month. Yes, it has. <laughs> if this payout came through, it looks like what appears everybody's been getting, a, a, a trickle. Now, you know how you take a piss in the toilet, right? And you know you take a piss and you're peeing and then you stop peeing, right? You're done. But what you got to do is you got to shake it, right? You shake it and those little drips that, you know, fall you know fall into the toilet from your, your unit, right? Those drips is what <laughs> Banger paid out to these guys. Those little drips and drabs of piss, you know. Uh, they they pissed on you, except they didn't give you the piss. They just give you drops of piss on you guys. And, uh, yeah, these, and that's all you got. Uh, are you kidding me? And there will be more. Uh, what will bring us 10 or $20 per month? The yield is higher than that. How can, I, how can you advertise with such problems? Uh, there will be more payouts this month in different volumes, not only $10, $20. Yeah, right. I will wait. Yeah, good luck with that shit, all right? It's a joke, and um, you got drips of piss, uh, all right? Not even the full, you know, rush, <laughs> I guess you could say. And so, uh, yeah, Banger has been done. They're only doing that just to make it look like they're doing something, but they're really not doing anything. It's done, all right? That, you, you can't convince me that, oh, they're paying out drips drips of uh drab and that oh yeah they're paying no and those guys are not convinced either so it's just funny as hell i just laugh at all this shit it's so funny and of course aladdin's update no official zoom scheduled last week as they will wait for information on trading and other matters uh website security levels remain high um blah 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 so they're still waiting for all kinds of stuff and it's already been said the the withdrawals are taking a very long time all right up to a week now and they've really slowed down from the very beginning so we all know Aladdin's writing is on the wall they're done all right they're done it's over so I don't know what the problem is of just announcing that they're over but I've already called them being over a while ago and it's unfortunate you know so with that, all right, uh, that's your latest here. Let's see if there's anything else to talk about here. Um, I don't think there's anything else to really talk about on this in this regard because um, it looks like I cover it all, all right? So with that, Shalay's updates on the Death Watch as... Uh, these platforms that seem to want to get people to still hang on for what? I don't know. But all I got to say is uh, all the stuff that they keep saying they're going to do and do and do. Yeah, good luck with all that shit, you know. And, uh, yeah, it's a lot of funny ass stuff. Comment down below. Uh, let me know what you think about all this stuff. And that is your latest Death Watch series. Um, I don't know why I just don't want to just admit it, you know. Oh, now I'll see you next one.